Hey guys, welcome to Wrestling Figure Wednesday. Today I'll be reviewing the Mattel WWE Elite Series 67 Randy Orton figure. You could currently get him on ringsidecollectibles.com. Save 10% with discount code MBG. It'll save you some dough and support yours truly, so thank you as always. I was very excited to get this figure. Finally another updated Orton. Um, one thing I didn't really like is I saw he's uh, pretty buff in terms of like his uh, shoulder... Uh, muscles and everything so his neck looks a lot smaller but we'll see once we open it it's just maybe the pictures I saw were a little goofy but he does come with some Randy Orton hands which is really cool one of them is the same as uh, Velveteen Dream's hand but he also comes with some uh, fists as well to swap it with and his entrance vest of course so that's pretty cool it is a more uh, current Orton with the longer hair as well so on this side you can see a picture of Randy has his name on this side on the back is a picture of him in his vest has some uh, statistics about him on the back also in the set is Shayna Baszler Jeff Hardy with a chase variant Cedric Alexander Velveteen Dream and a flashback Rey Mysterio so that being said let's take a look at him fresh out of the packaging all right guys so here we have the elite 67 Randy Orton figure fresh out of the packaging overall I'd say it's a really really nice elite him so far um, it's probably my favorite elite of him to date personally it just looks just like him of course he has a new true FX technology his uh, skin is pretty similar to uh, his basic 94 that just came out but it's still actually a little bit different the hair color is different and whatnot so uh, I'll show you that real quick it's a quick comparison of the two I think the right one looks even more accurate, but yeah, his facial hair is painted a lot more realistically on the right versus the left, so it's pretty cool. But uh, he does come with swappable hands, which I'll show you real quick first before I really get into his review. But uh, you can see they're taped fist. It's too bad the pegs aren't painted. Well, actually, in this case, it works well because it's close to where the tape is. I don't like, well, see on this side it looks silly though. So, I don't know. I wish Mattel could figure out that issue. Maybe make the pegs always skin tone, so I don't know. Just me being super anal about it because it will look a little bit silly. But besides that, here he is again up close. Amazing skin, looks just like him. He's got his longer hair. See the detail in his beard. It's fantastic. He's got his hoodie see the logo on it there a little RKO logo here unfortunately they didn't paint the uh, laces on it or the zipper area like in the picture on his box it is all white so I don't know if you're that anal about it like me you could probably touch it up I might have my friend touch that up for me uh, after this review and whatnot but uh, this does come off it's a thicker rubber so as you can see I'm having a bit of a fight with it. It's not horrible, but it is not as soft as some of the other rubber goods lately, so just be very careful as you can see. It's not the easiest to remove. There we go. So it's a little bit stiffer rubber, so you can see the hood and everything too, which is really nice. So just be careful with that. But here he is out of it. His uh, shoulders actually don't look bad at all like they did online to me he looks actually pretty good he does have a neck so that was my biggest concern seeing some image of it it could just been the perspective of it you see how the detail in his tattoo work very very nice and of course he has his Randy Orton hands so he could do his taunt which is really cool like I said if you don't want him with these hands you could always swap them out and then uh, he does have the blue designs on his trunks. You can see that there. It's kind of hard to see just because it's so dark. And it says Orton on his butt there as well. If you can see that. And he's got his black knee pads and just uh, black boots with the laces. So if you uh, haven't gotten Orton in a while or just really want a current one, I highly recommend this one. This is easily my favorite of him to date that even if they never made another one this would be a great one uh, to satisfy me for a while I would say and uh, like I said 
You can currently get him on ringsidecollectibles.com. Save 10% with discount code MBG at checkout. Be sure to like Wrestling Figure Wednesday on Facebook to suggest future reviews you would like to see me do, and I will see you soon. Thanks. Like this video? Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more. And check out my latest videos. For all your wrestling figure needs, check out ringsidecollectibles.com.